Hi children, now I am going to read a short story for you, The Lion's Share. Now enjoy listening, okay, and understand the meaning of the story and learn the moral, okay. Now let us see the story. Before entering into the story, we have to differentiate among fox, jackal and wolf. Shall we? Yes. Now let me tell what is a fox. A wild animal similar to a small dog with red brown fur, a pointed face and a thick tail. Okay. Fox is nothing but it's a wild animal. It's like a small dog. Kuti nai mari kuma with red brown fur. Okay, wa? pointed face. A lot of face abdi kuma pointed abdi kura abdi kura abdi kuma. Okay, that is pointed. It has a thick tail. Okay, that's a fox. Now come to this jackal. What is this? It is also a wild animal like a dog that lives in Asia and Africa. That's it. Okay, next is wolf. What is this wolf? It is also a wild animal similar to a large dog that lives in groups. So this is large and fox is a small. Okay, you should know the difference among these animals though it belongs to the same family. Also they are all from the forest so they are all wild animals including this lion. Okay, wild animals. Shall I start reading now? Yes, thank you. The lion's share. One day, the lion invited a fox, a jackal and a wolf to his den. You know what is a den? Yes, that's it. The animals came at once. I want to go hunting. Will you join me? Said the lion or asked the lion. Everyone agreed and went hunting with the lion. They caught a deer and killed it. The lion was pleased with their hunt. He divided the prey into four parts while the other animals kept looking at it hungrily. Pointing to the four pieces of the prey, the lion said, The first part is mine. Okay, because I was a part of this chase. Okay, the second part is also mine because I am the king of the jungle. The third part also goes to me as I am the strongest. As for the fourth part, let me see who dares to lay a paw upon it. So it is blackmailing, it is threatening the fox and a jackal and wolf. Okay, do you understand? Yes, the fox, the jackal and the wolf went back starving as they knew that they could not fight the lion. Okay, what is the moral of the story? The moral is never trust a wicked person to treat you fairly. Okay, never trust a wicked person to treat you fairly. That's it. Okay. Be careful in your life while you cross the people like this. Okay. So never trust those people. Yes. Thank you for watching this. May God bless you all.